I look kind of weird, but whatever. Okay, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a little mini haul. Everything that I have here, I've obviously bought throughout like the months. I didn't buy a lot of things just because I know the baby shower is going to be coming up, which is actually next month. And I just wanted to wait and to, like I just wanted to wait to see like what I did receive during that time, and then obviously you know buy whatever I didn't. And um, I, I just didn't want to go crazy and then receive like multiple things during the baby shower. So with that being said, we'll go with the baby clothes first. Cause baby clothes are really cute. Okay. So I have them, no, hold on. Hold on. Uh, okay, I'm gonna put it in my lap. Okay, so I have his bin. Okay, it's getting so hot behind these lights. And then it's like, it's so hard to breathe. All right, so the first thing that I got for him, well it's not the first thing that I bought, but you know, I have it in order. So this is a newborn. His theme is Twinkle Twinkle Little Star for his baby shower. So I thought this was so fitting because it says, can you see that? Like it says, welcome to the world. And it's so cute. Comes with a little hat. Oh, yeah, comes with a little beanie. And then it's a footsie one. I need to get him mittens if I do decide to make this his going home outfit from the hospital. And this one was, if you care, was 16 no, actually $12 at Dillard's. So yeah, let's see. Okay, so the next thing is we went to Carter's. We went during Black Friday. We just stopped by. I really didn't want to go shopping too much because obviously it's Black Friday and it gets crazy and I'm pregnant and I'm not trying to deal with all that. But anyway, so we went to Carter's and they were having, I think, 50% off or 60% off um, the whole store during Black Friday. And we just got him this one. This one's a newborn as well. And I was thinking either that one be for his going home outfit or this one maybe one of them is for the photo shoot that i'm gonna do for him but yeah so it comes with the little top and it's so cute with the little koala and the hippo and little socks and then his of course a little beanie and his little pants are so cute this one was 26 so then 60 percent off of this more than that we don't know and then i also picked up him some little pants because we don't really have a lot of these but like I said, I wasn't really trying to spend a lot, especially like on newborn clothes, because he's going to grow out of them so fast. But then again, like I said, I don't know what I'm going to be receiving for the baby shower, so there's that. And this was 22 I got an H&M, look how cute. And the only thing about this one is, since in Texas, you know, it kind of gets hot and then it's like kind of cold as well. But um, this one's zero to one month, and obviously this is going to be inside, he's not going to wear it outside because... He's going to be due in February, which is kind of still cold in Texas. And then, um, yeah, but also it might be hot. So for the days that it's a little bit warmer, I'm going to throw him in this. But obviously, like I said, I'm not taking him out in this because it might be a little too cold. The original price for this one was $14, and I got it for $7 at H&M. I was looking at the clearance section when I went because obviously you can always find some good things there. And this one's also a 0 to 3, and we just got him a little Astros onesie can you see my face yes we also got a little astros onesie this one's cute um we bought this one actually we didn't even know if we were having a boy or a girl but i thought it was cute either way if it was a girl you know throw like a little tutu on but obviously we're having a boy so either way it was gonna go with the outfit i mean actually it was gonna be gender neutral i guess you would say i don't know but yeah so this is his little Zero to three months, little Astros one. And this one, I actually didn't get it on sale. I bought this one full price because I missed out on the Winnie the Pooh one and I really, really wanted the Winnie the Pooh, but I didn't know if I was having a boy or a girl. So, yeah. But um, I missed out on the Winnie the Pooh one, but they had this little Tigger one, which is so cute. Look at the little beanie. He comes with Tigger on it, little, little baby Tigger. And then his pants, like the pants are so freaking cute like a little waistband and all that so yes yeah, so this, this one's um oh can i talk so yeah this one is two to four months and this was 14.99 which is not that bad because you get the pants the top and the little hat then the next one is this little two pack that i got from h&m a lot of it is from h&m because they were like i said they were having a good sale so i was kind of picking up a few things but i didn't want to go too crazy because obviously the baby shower anyway so yeah so this one is a four to six months and it just has little bears on it for this one and then on the back is just a plain blue one so yeah and this is four to six months originally five i mean originally 9.99 i got it for five dollars so you can always find some really cute affordable things at each time even like even 
for it not being on sale like I think the prices are still pretty affordable for like baby clothes in general like women's clothes too because that place is pretty affordable and then oh this one this one we got when we went to Destin Florida this is when I found out I was pregnant but we did, obviously didn't know what I was having so but um yeah so this is where we found out I was pregnant um and obviously we wanted to get something for him or her and yeah so it worked out because it's a boy and you know the blue but it's so cute because it has like little animals on it but I'm so excited for this one because obviously it has memories behind it and this one was $12.99 and we got it at like one of those I guess like surf shops that they had over there but yeah it just looks like that little tie-dye moment and then oh you guys this right here so we went on a cruise oh I put this down so we went so we went on a cruise a few months back and there was like this little shop oh, look how cute it's just like a little dad shirt you know and then it comes with the pants and this one's a one t so i was thinking for his birthday we can do like a little um havana night and we got the hat oh i'll show you the hat but yeah so we got him this little outfit with the hat but obviously it's down there and i'll get it in a few minutes when i show you the other things but um yeah so we're gonna do like a little havana night for his birthday when he turns one i already got the theme hopefully he fits into this because i don't know it says on one t but you know we don't know how big the baby's gonna be or how big he might be in general oh my god am i sweating i am um... so i also got this two pack of I guess you would say like these little uh, tanks. I don't know. Um, and this is six to nine months. Obviously, it'll be like summer warm time. So just throw them in this, lounge around the house, or put some cute little pants on, like this right here. You know, something jeans, cargo shorts, whatever. And this one was nine ninety nine, but we got it for four dollars. So I guess it's like obviously, when I, the time I went, it's like getting cold. So all the summer clothes happened to be on sale so I just like I said pick some stuff up oh it's so hot behind these lights okay and then um the little dinosaur shorts originally $9.99 I got them for five dollars how cute oh my god the amount of times I said cute goodness gracious six to nine months as well and then this one this one glows in the dark but it's like Bucky's because you know we were on a road trip to Dallas and it was Halloween time and I thought this was so cute. So by the time Halloween comes around, he will fit this. It's little Bucky's ghost. And like I said, it glows in the dark. This one was 12 months. The $14.99. Cute little black t-shirt for Halloween. Mudworth. Sorry if I'm talking to you guys. I'm like kind of excited because I haven't filmed in a while. And then it's kind of like, oh my god, how do I even film? Yeah, so that's where I'm at. But it's so hot and i'm wearing this jacket but it's like really cold outside and then the heater upstairs is like so strong and it's like so hot but then like downstairs it's so cold and i just don't get it so i picked up a little a uh, little this is huge actually this is his diaper bag i liked it because it has rose gold on it um this little thing latches on to the stroller so we just throw that in there but it's like pretty like spacious yeah so these little straps right here hook onto the stroller which i thought was pretty cool um this bag was a hundred dollars but since i work at mac that's inside of a dillard's we also get employee discount so i picked this up when we were having the double employee discount and um it came out to like 60 bucks which is totally worth it because like this the material feels really good on it um so this is the back it comes with a little changing pad still attached but obviously like this is going to be his uh hospital bag and then his diaper bag um now like i said it's very spacious so that's that's that and then it has like how am i going to do this it's huge so it has like this big back room to stuff whatever i need to which probably will be like diapers and stuff and why be since this is the changing pad and all that so that'll probably be the designated spot for it this part right here you could put i don't know bottles i really don't know i don't know what i'm doing <laughs> just kidding and then of course you got all this space in here 
which I'm going to do a what's in my hospital bag and then transition to the what's in my um, diaper bag. Yeah, <laughs> I'm going to my one blank. And uh, they have like some sp space in here for some things. Um, and actually I was talking to one of my coworkers and she said that her sisters had hers. <sighs> she said that her sister had her, um, has hers for like a few years and it's still like in really good condition and she still uses it to this day for her kids and her baby's like a toddler now so you know it works out and then of course this has a lot of space in here too for the front pocket it's pretty spacious like this in general is pretty spacious so you know to each its own but yeah it's a nice little backpack throw on put on the stroller but black for when his dad has them. I like one of those traditional diaper bags, the ones that look like a diaper bag. I just wanted a backpack because I feel like it would be easier to carry. It has the straps and then it has the two straps for the stroller. So it was like a lot justified for that bag. But even though it wasn't like expensive, you know, but $100 originally if I didn't work there is kind of pricey for a bag. So that's that. Oh my God, it's like so hot. I don't know why I decided to do this. Remember how I was talking about that little outfit? This is the hat. Look how cute. It's so cute. So when we do do the little Havana night, and that's where, does it say where we got it from? Oh yeah, Cozumel, Mexico. It does say it. Why is it not focusing? Is it focusing? Yeah, so Cozumel, Mexico, that's where we got it. Look how cute. It's so cute. Anyways, but that's with his little Havana night outfit. And then, you know, I'm so excited. I got a new camera. And obviously, I don't know if you could tell, but I got the Rebel T7i. And, like, with my other camera that I had was obviously a vlogging camera. So every time I would film on it, it would, like, overheat. And this one has not just yet. And I felt like by the time that I was filming on that camera, it would already overheat. So, yeah, I was, like, so happy about that. Okay, so this... This little bag that we've accumulated little things for Alex. And that's my baby's name for I have a photo doll. But um yeah, so his name is Alex. Um I got him this little three pack bandana bibs. So it's this one day fun day. And then it has the little football down here. This one I think is yeah, just a plain blue one. But I got this one because his dad loves sports, so you know. He got a little buddy now. But this was $3.99 at Marshalls. Love Marshalls. And then um, he got this whenever him and his brother went to like the little Texas training camp and he bought this for Alex. Little teddy bear. So cute. This one, if you care, was $14.99 at the Texan shop. And then um, this little puppy was from Jax's little birthday party and it says thank you for celebrating one year with me he turned to one and I thought it was so cute so we got it but um obviously it's kind of too tiny for him to like play with at the moment so this will be like later on when he's a little bit bigger so I saw these at Walmart and they're so cute they're little dinosaur slippers um because our house gets a little cold and these are newborn how much were these these are really cheap I want to say it was like $4.99 or something at Walmart they just don't have a price on them. But it's the uh, Child of Mine made by Carter's, but like for Walmart. Um, they don't really have like a lot of padding, but obviously he's not going to be walking when he's a newborn. But it's just enough to keep his little feet warm. And then I got some matching gloves, or mitts, and they have little dinosaurs on them. And then this one's like the little dinosaur paws. So cute. And this is the newborn. Yeah, I want to say this was super cheap. I want to say they were like $4.99 each. This also... Um, we didn't know the gender just yet, but we had bought this when we went to one of the games. It's just the Houston Astros, baby Astros, little thing. We got it at the um, store. Yeah, this was like his first like actual item. And then this one was $20 pricey, but I thought it was cute because, you know, his dad likes high head sports. So we had to pick some things up for him. This was like my favorite purchase. So like I said, his theme is Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, but it obviously has like a little bit of elephants in it. Um, and his room, I'll show you, but mainly it's like very neutral gray, white colors. But I saw this at Marshall's for $9.99 and it's basically this huge elephant. 
that he could like have tummy time on or just lay on it, you know, when we're just chilling in the living room or whatever. Um, it's very, very soft. Like, I'm so excited about this because we went to Bye Bye Baby and they had one, the material on it, just for the price alone, was like a hundred dollars or like a hundred or no, I want to say like 50, not a hundred. I think a hundred was too much, but 50. And like, it was thinner, so it didn't have so much cushion in it. And like, the elephant itself wasn't cute. And I was like, wow, like, I got a pretty good steal on this because when I had went to buy my baby, I was looking at these anyways, and I was just like, no, nah, I'm gonna wait. And then we went to, um, I went to Marshall's. I go to Marshall's, it's like literally down the street. So I went to Marshall's and I saw this and I was like, oh my God, I have to get it because it's like better made for $50. Yeah, right, I'm not paying for that. So like I said, it has, it's like very cushioned. And like I said, at um, Bye Bye Baby, it was like half. It was like so thin, but yeah. So that is that. I'm so excited about him. He's a little cute friend. I don't have a name to him yet. And then this is for his bedroom. We got this. It says, how wonderful life is now that you are in our world. So that's what it says. It's pretty cute. We got this at um, Home Goods for $16.99. And like I said, a lot of these items, I didn't know what I was having. I wanted a very gender neutral either way. Because if I have another child, you know, some of this stuff can be reused and repurposed. So it's not like just a waste and one, one bedroom has a theme. So yeah, um, that's why I kind of went with that. It's very neutral, very, very, you know gender neutral is what I'm trying to say but that is all for my baby haul I do want to do like a maybe what I got for my baby shower that's not going to be until like February because my baby shower is February 11th and today is oh it's exactly one month away because today is December 11th I don't know hopefully this video is good because I just forgot how to talk to a camera thank you guys for watching thank you for guys for still sticking around and being subscribed if you're not subscribed please subscribe and hopefully I can have some videos up soon. I know I've kind of like taken like a year off and then I'll post one month and then I'll like take off for another month. But I really, really, really do want to get back into it because when I do, I get excited and like it's, you know, fun for me. And then now that I have a baby, we can, you know, document his journey. I do want to do like obviously what's in my bag, my hospital bag, and then obviously what's going to be in my diaper bag. And then... I do want to do the, not necessarily the baby shower itself, I can vlog a little bit, but I know I'm going to be like very occupied, so maybe I'll have a sister or somebody kind of do a behind the scenes of the baby shower, or just kind of vlog, take over the vlog for me. We can do that, and whenever we go looking for like the baby shower stuff, I can take you along with me on that if y'all want. So, yeah. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys later.